Hi, my name's Fred Nye, co-founder of The Argonauts. And my name's Dan Edwards, star power of the team. Uh, today's video is the, a little talk behind why we got the Planet Clips knee pads. So, as you see, this is uh, Dan's, Dan's royal chair. This is his day chair. Nice this this chair. is not the chair that I play in. The chair that I play in has got a bit more bucket in it. Stop me tumbling out. Uh, the rules are a little bit more cambered. And what you tend to find is your knees are the most prominent thing in the front. Yeah. Which is not a good thing when you're no. this guy's height. No, I'm, I'm, I'm six foot five, so my knees stick out pretty far, especially because your the foot plate is just a little bit further back as well. So, um, yeah, when you come out of your chair and things like that, the first thing that hits the floor is normally your knees, if you're trying to keep hold of the ball, or is your elbows. The Argonauts are an all-inclusive wheelchair sports charity, and we predominantly play wheelchair rugby league. Shout out to them guys, good job, keep it up. And um, yeah, as soon as we started playing the game, the more and more we played, the more my knees took a battering. So uh, reminiscing of my painful days back when, uh, back, back when I was a young dad. Skipping through the, uh, the it's bunkers. A long while ago, mate, man. Yeah. Um, so I bought myself a pair of these knee pads, and uh, after playing in the league for a little bit, uh, a few of the other able-bodied players came and uh, well, they were talking to me about knee pads and where I got them from and stuff like that. So um, I thought it'd be a good idea, especially from the charity side of things, to contact Planet Eclipse, and um, actually they they ended up sponsoring us, which was amazing. Uh, thank you very much. Really thanks, guys. And uh, they sent us a big old box of uh, knee pads and a few other things. Uh, we've got an unboxing video if you haven't seen that. Check that out. It's funny. Definitely have a little look. Um, yeah, let me just show one on. So while Fred's doing that, um, I don't tend to use mine. I've got a spinal cord injury at level T89, so which is around here. So I don't feel anything below that level. Uh, so my knees, so I, it's just my personal choice. You can wear them if you want to. I tend to don't just through these. Now what I do use are the overload elbow pads. Now these are brilliant. So they protect my elbows, as you can tell. Uh, mainly, from, well. mainly from uh, mainly from chafage on the wheels, and if I do tend to come out, which I do because I'm such a good player, uh, it stops the uh, the chafing on the floor. So I'm just going to slap one of these on for you, pass you on the thread. Well, yeah, my main thing why I wear them is uh, I managed to chip both of my elbows in one, in one oh, match. Hold on, nice one, nice one. If only there was like a right and left on the inside. <laughs> Can't tell. I need my um, you need what? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so another thing, obviously these are mine, they do actually, they come blank green, uh, the only reason I, I, I coloured in the E's just because we can see them apart, so don't try and look for the, there we go. the black E's. Here's the elbow pads. pads. But um, yeah, so I managed to chip, like I said, I managed to chip both of my elbows, which is uh, it's pretty painful, because obviously you've got to try and keep hold of the ball whilst you're getting catapulted out of, uh, out of your wheelchair, which is, is great fun. Always. Yeah, but like he says, it's fundamental for obviously when you catch the ball, it's quite hard to then your movement in the chair is very easy. Your hands are quite occupied. Yeah. So, what, um, what, what Fred and I tend to do with some of the other players on the team? Well, it's actually it's mainly the stable players because obviously when you're catching a ball, he's then, he's, well, he's got a balance on top of his torso. Yeah. So, if he has to reach out or anything like that, it's like, right. So, so let, me, let me demonstrate. So, if it's because I'm paralysed from here, my core stability isn't as good. So if I tend to lean this way, I will fall on my wheels, which then, one, protects my skin with these elbow pads, and I can also use it, if I've got control of the ball, I can touch that wheel, and with the agility and stuff of my, my rugby chair, it will help me steer the chair to left and right, so I can use that to my ability. There you go, in a nutshell, give away all the trade secrets. <laughs> Looking at you, Medway. Don't tell my secrets. Oh, actually, a little pro. There's a uh, Velcro straps on the top and bottom of these. Obviously, when you sit down, they're not going to slide anywhere. So what I tend to use it for, because in rugby league, as you can see by the Velcro patches here, you have Velcro tags on your on your arms, and so to basically it's to register a tackle, you have to pull the the, the tag off of the arm. So this little bit of Velcro on top is really handy for holding the tags that you have to re-tag up on, because I can hold three on each knee without having a belt that's over my lap to hold a load of tags on. So I can just quickly rip them off and stick them on. Quickly. Yeah, which is great. Um, the padding itself comes in two layers. 
there's an internal one and then this external one that you can see. Uh, it slightly wraps around the knee, which is awesome. There's a little cut in here, that, so it all comes together nicely. Um, actually, the only, the only con I would say is the difference between the size of medium and large. They do jump up quite yeah, a bit. There's a, there's a big gap, like the arms. The large is just... I mean, I think, me, this, I think this is the large. This is the large. This is the large of me, and, and you can see this. I mean, miles. Well, it's not that. Large, but just to stretch it, it's more this bit up here. Yeah, not me. So that's a little bit baggy because that's the large. That's why it's my large. Yeah. But so when I put on, it's a little bit baggy. So I ideally want something a little bit tighter to stop them from sliding down. But the mediums. So are the mediums are a lot smaller. Tall, uh, tall. Tall. Small. 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 Tight. Yeah. Tight. The mediums are a lot smaller, so it's hard to actually get them in. Plus, they've got quite long arms, which doesn't help either. Um, but other than that, I mean, there's only one real test I've got for the knee pads. Um, Dan, if you don't mind. Brilliant. Ah! I say, oh, good, good. <laughs> <laughs> you can't oh, yeah. feel it! Oh, yeah, do, do that again. <laughs> <laughs> That's my normal oh, reaction. Oh, I do that all the time. Harder. Just, uh, I'm just going to put this out there. Dan is disabled and he is in the I, I promise I have in no case, feeling it. Was something like, in case <laughs> any <laughs> automatic reaction to go out. <laughs> in case any any people for, I don't know, anyone trying to look into Dan for benefit fraud or, you know. I any, just use it sympathy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he can't actually feel his leg. Although he went, ow! There, there's no feeling here. It's like. <laughs> So this brings me to the part of my bit of the test. <laughs> you, can, <laughs> you can do this all day long, but <laughs> so, yeah, this gladly, is, gladly. Yeah. This is what brings me to my part of the test. So Fred doesn't claim any benefits, isn't disabled, has full sensation I in his legs. My leg, yeah. So this is this is obviously ones with the uh, with the knee pads on. No feeling. Practically paralysed. Let me try the knee. Oh, I have one. Oh, no, no. <laughs> oh, no, no this, 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 this is a general oh, no. test. No, they got it. You're fine. I mean, I think, if anything, you need to show that you're disabled rather than me. This is going to get it. Ow! <laughs> you, you <laughs> no, it's all right. I'll let you. You can lean on that, because you know. It's gonna be a mark there. <laughs> That's hilarious. You said out. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so, <laughs> there shouldn't be a mark. There won't be a mark. Oh, no, sorry, what? Yeah, there is a little. There's bit. a mark. Okay, that, that and that'll be a bruise. Bad. My bad. But um, but yeah. So these these are great. As you can see, just hit me in the in the, in the knee with a bit of MDF there. I was it 18 mil. Yeah, I mean it's, it's big enough. I mean no. <laughs> so there's a difference, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. So. The the uh, the knee pads are a godsend. No, I've got to do shows next. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about that. It'll be fine. <laughs> so you can see that the knee pads are a godsend, uh, uh, as well as the elbow pads. Same with the elbow. I'm pads. guessing we don't no, need I'm to. Not. We don't need well, to. Well, oh, actually no. <laughs> I technically I haven't hit you. No. Not where you can feel it. <laughs> Come on, let's have a go on the elbow. No, I don't even like that. You could do it, do it with it. No, with that one. No, well, there's your pad. No, no pad. <laughs> it's not good. <laughs> that was soft. I that felt was bad. really soft. I felt bad. That's but, like, that's, uh, that's just kind of yeah. Just get rid of that. Easy to do. But um, yeah, in general, they're they're awesome. So definitely check them out, guys. Brilliant. Thank but, you very yeah. much. We really like to say uh, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Also, give a shout out to uh, go go and have a look at Planet Eclipse. Give them a little like. I mean, it is a big step for them to. To sponsor something like us, I mean, there's no way that like I was talking to them and he was just interested in it, generally interested, and I showed him a couple of things and we got a sponsorship from a paintball company for, for a, wheelchair rugby a team. very small wheelchair rugby league team. Which, which is yeah, I mean, please go and uh, give them a follow or a like. Try to build the sport, yeah, uh, promote, promote it, and uh, get people involved in it. But yeah, thanks a lot, guys. Thank you very much. See Ciao. you next time. Mate, that was good. Did I just caught, you that hard? No, you caught the top of my knee, <laughs> <laughs> I'm so tempted to just be like, motherfucker! <laughs>